Okay, so I'm back to using the phone thing. I think actually is a better camera than the one on my computer. So I'm gonna use this one for a minute. Um, I have a poem. It is called Dear Cameron. To heal the world and save the children, collect the stars in your pocket, sprinkle them across the land, sing them all a lullaby, your voice is like a whisper. You are one who is strong, but so very gentle. To give away yourself to save another. You come and open your soul to all of us. There is an air around you. You feel all our pain and celebrate with us in joy. You never hold yourself first, except to lead those that have no path. Those that are lost, and to heal the world and save the nations, save the children and all the people. You collect all the stars, sprinkle them across the land, sing them all a lullaby, your voice a savior, a savior of their demise, your lullaby a whisper, a whisper that saves and sings, peace and love. That's your poem, Cameron. Um, so Cameron is awesome and fantastic. And in my earlier uh, YouTube videos, I talk about reading out loud in group and how sometimes I would just get this reaction from people. And Cameron was one of those people who would just make me feel like I created the moon and the stars with my poetry. I mean, he is just all about peace and love and if he could change the world by giving himself up to it, he would do it in a heartbeat. And I think he's one of the very, very few people in this world who genuinely would do that. You know, we all want to send water to Fiji and we all want to send food to South Africa or Africa and we all want to save the Syrians and blah 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 but I think if the almighty anything offered Cameron the choice to give himself up to save the world to really create and inspire love and peace he'd do it in a blink of an eye. So Cameron, I hope you like your poem. I hope you could hear it okay. Um, and just as a reminder, there it is, Cameron. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go, Cameron. Hope you like it.